Good luck with your marriage. I hope it, uh, it's everything that you expect. Good luck, Greg and Bob. Anything to say to Greg and Bonnie? Anything at all? Please, no. <laughs> the first one's off? Oh, is that all you got to say? Oh, come on, son. You can do better than that. <laughs> hey, Greggy. Congratulations. It's about time you finally tied the knot. That's all. <laughs> That's all. Come on. Congratulations. What's your what's your fondest memory of Uncle Greg? Uh, fondest memory? Fishing. Fishing? Where did he take you fishing? I took him fishing. <laughs> oh, and then we know he did he did well, right? Oh yeah. He uh, washed the pool and drank beer. <laughs> well, he snores a lot. And he's really tall. He likes to play basketball. And uh, he's a basketball coach. He used to be a basketball coach. And he's now a baseball coach. Is he your favorite uncle? Um, yeah. Well, on, on, my dad's side of the family. Um, that's it for me. He had a chance to enjoy it with his wife, and you know, the wife ended up having it, and then ended up, uh, I don't know, abandoning the thing, or selling it to uh, she did, but it's still a centerpiece up there. Something about Greg. Oh, gosh. I, I remember him from... You're right in my face, Ned. Was, was he a nice boy? He was a very nice boy, and he was... Uh, let's see, Greg was six months old when he moved across the road. That's right, because he's Brian's age. And, yeah, very nice, very nice boy. Well behaved. Well, 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 sort of, as well as any of the kids, like the morale kids and, you know, all that. So, so. And, uh, let's see. That's, yeah. It's a turn it off. Yes, my She's got a dishes, but you know what? Let her win some and let him win some. Your mom has a go for You having fun? Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm next. Yeah. What am I doing? What, what do you have to say about Greg? What do I have to say about Greg? What do I have to say about Greg? Anything at all. Anything at all. See your favorite brother? Oh, uh, absolutely. You gotta be your favorite brother. Burgers and we're cooking chicken and we got hot dogs and hamburgers in here. Whoa! It's a little smoky. You can't probably see them. What do you got, hickory in there? Oak and I got more. Can can eat here? I'm gonna break them up. I'll have to think about it, Mike. Come back after a few more I beers. think it's about time Greg got married. The it's last one. The last Kendall. That's it. Did you think it was ever going to happen? Never. That's all anybody Never. ever says. We're glad he's getting married. Yep, we're glad he's getting married. Yep. Go ahead, Tom. Congratulations, Greg. I never <laughs> thought it would happen. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I stand here people thinking the same thing. <laughs> yeah. And then maybe you can have one of these. Yeah. <laughs> now, all right, we've got the sodas Problem. and the cups. Let's bring them up, guys. That's all for me. Cut. Oh, he's... <laughs> Why are you hiding? I should probably hide, too, Mike. You can't hide. What's up? There's Mr. Mike. Let's, uh, let's hear about the wine selection. Here, over here. Um, blend of Cab, Merlot, Cabernet Franc. It's very elegant, very smooth, very polished tannin, lots of food. <laughs> it's very, very nice wine. Um, the this one here is a 95 Sonoma Station Zin from Ridge that um, they use some Petit Syrah and Alicante and um, it's 
predominantly Zin, but it's a wonderful blend, lots of fruit, pretty good amount of tannin, but huge fruit. It's wonderful. This is a regular Shiraz from Australia, Chateau Reynella. It's a basket press, meaning it uses balloons to press the grapes and uh, doesn't release as much tannin into the wine as the free run juice that goes in. Lots of fruit, plum, cherry, but a spiciness to it. It's really good. This Pinot Noir by Rocchioli. Um, very elegant, refined, a lot of jammy, uh, cherry, raspberry, uh, strawberry characteristics to the wine. It's really nice. A little bit of tannin, but not bad. And this is for cigars later. It's about 10 years old, ready to open. I've been saving this one for you, Mike. Oh! Let's go with a little stogie, but um, it's a quinta, which means it's a single vineyard port. Some ports, um, in fact, a lot of ports end up blending a lot of different vineyards together to make up their port. This one's single. That's actually, uh, I've had that story very, very good. This one here is a Maggio. This is uh, by Segazio. It's uh, another red blend wine, but um, it's one of their best wines. They take 56 acres of their best stuff and they blend it together to make it real nice elegant type bread. So that's a selection. Of course you already know about Sam Adams and the tri triple box. Um, this is actually from their first vintage. So we're gonna find out hopefully a little bit later how it is aged. It's brewed with maple syrup, so it's very different. And then we got of course oh a few uh, pieces of liquor. This is probably my favorite gin here. The ten. Uh, just smooth, got a lot of flavor to it. It's made by Tangeray, but obviously the name indicates uh, it's kept for 10 years before it ends up being bottled in. I don't talk. He doesn't talk. He I can hear you talking. Greg and Bonnie know that. Good luck to all of them, and let's, let's hope they have a good luck. Yeah. That's good. As many years as you guys. Yeah. Bonnie and Greg, best of luck. It was great to meet the kids. Hope you have a lot of happy years together. Yep. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> um, oh, that's it. I was going to say. <laughs> that's it, uh, Congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah, congratulations on um, Bonnie and Greg, and hope they have a good, good life and good seasons. <laughs> <laughs> congratulations and much happiness in the future. From Ellie. And Ellie. <laughs> That's all right. He thanks Bonnie for taking my last son and finally getting him out of my hair. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations and hope you have many happy years together. Good marriage. Happy New Year. Congratulations, Bonnie. She'll be back. Hey, why don't you open the thing up where you can see what it looks like? All right. Congratulations. Um, you guys are the best. Fool. <laughs> this could be trouble. <laughs> Look in my eyes, it'll tell you the truth. <laughs> marriage. The three rings of marriage, you'll figure them out. Nice girl, I'm happy for you. And like, <laughs> hey, tell me what I look like in there. All right. Congratulations, great girl. You know, 452 batting average out of the boy. <laughs> we'll see you in uh, August, and then we'll really see whether you pull through with the deal. And I'm happy for you. Hang on, I gotta think about it for a minute. Say something I know. Say something profound, Julie. I'm ready. Greg, Bonnie, you guys are the best, and I wish you all of the happiness in the world. Cheers. Love you guys. Mwah. How are you? So, uh, any wishes for uh, Greg and Bonnie? Have a happy life together. Love each other always. Be nice. Hi, Greg. It's Chrissy, as you know. Well, you know what? I provided your housing for two years, and I was glad to do it. And I finally found you this wonderful wife who would put up with you with all of your quirks. But if you think I'm being your surrogate mother, it's not going to happen. Bye. <laughs> Uh, I'd practice with Casey. I'll never forget this one time with Casey. He, Casey was a little infant, 
I'll never forget changing his diapers um, in the um, the living room one day, and I freaked out. I will never forget it because his poop was blue, red, green, and yellow. It had Roy G. Biv spectrum through the whole thing. And all I know is I freaked out. I said to my mom, who's in the kitchen, I go, Mom, Mom, come here, quick, quick. Take a look at this kid. This kid is Not ill. <laughs> it's sick. It's gonna die. Look at this poop. <laughs> it was bad. So anyhow, I got a few. My mom's. Well, what's funny is my mom's like, ah. <laughs> Casey ate a crayon. I go a series of crayons. Oh my gosh. So she filled me in. So I'm sure Bonnie, yeah. haven't been through it twice, will fill me in on the um, now, how, better how parts. Part seven. Yeah, so we. Boy, that's who. Uh, 